Hello and welcome to yet another chat with your Mayor Mark Jepson. Today it's uh, great to talk to an old friend of mine who's Alex Till from Mentor. Hello Alex, how are you? Hi Mark, how are you? I'm not too bad, thank you. Good man. Now I know you're a man of many, many talents. You've obviously started art and you've done a self-portrait. It needs a bit of work, but I'm sure you're going to get there. No, we're going to get there, Mark, but I'm not going to say which one's me on the back screen. It's probably, I mean, with the way I feel at the minute, it's probably the guy with the hat on and the skull. Um, but yeah, it's, it's nice for you to mention it, Mark. This is one of our new sites. It's, um, it's a co-working space for those people who want to work closer to home and not actually at home. Because with the whole scenario around small business at the moment, we're seeing that a lot of people do need their space. Um, yeah. And it's not necessarily at home with partners and children um, because they're all trying to juggle a whole range of different things right now. And keeping in business and keeping motivated and keeping focused is really, really important. So we've created a new space which um, which can support those. Unfortunately, it's not in Felixstowe. Um, or we haven't created one in Felixstowe yet, I will yet. say, Mark. Yet. Absolutely. Because there's Absolutely. always opportunity. There's always well, the ability. And where there's a vision and, the, and, and, and enough people to take things further forward, we'd be more than happy to look at something which we could do along these lines as well. And you know, you know, we're looking at that. So if you're if you're a business either struggling at the moment, feeling so, or thinking actually I've got an idea I want to set up, they can come and speak to you, can't they? They can indeed, Mark. And we've got many people from Felixstowe um, who've actually contacted us. The website is really simple. It's www.menta.org.uk. You can contact us on 01284 760 206. And as always, Mark, you know my door is always open or my email box is always open. Um, so you can come to me directly. And that is Alex at menta, M-E-N-T-A, .org.uk. Um, and as I say, we've got a lot of people who have been furloughed, um, who are looking at where their future may hold from part-time jobs to looking at running their own business themselves. Um, and we can do all of those sorts of things from a pre-start business idea going, I think I might have an idea, can I chat it through? Um, we can help you with that. Right away through to offering um, fully funded, there is a cost, but it's not to the end user, um, of workshops which are delivered online through Zoom with real people. So you can actually have a dialogue with them. Um, and that covers things like business planning, marketing, cash flow forecasting. And then as always, Mark, we always offer the ability for someone just to talk to one of our business advisors um, and enable them, you know, to have a chat. Because at the end of the day, Mark, none of us are getting out there. None of us are talking. None of no. us are really able to spar these ideas or, shall I say, have a swearing partner um, where they may want to take things further forward. So we can offer all of those things. Um, and it's yeah. really simple and it's really easy, Mark. Great. I mean, it, 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 there's a lot of uncertainty out there, isn't there? And there's probably a lot, Massive. Of, a lot of businesses thinking... Where do I go from here? Because an yeah. independent, often by definition, works on their own. And they may never have considered contacting you and saying, look, give me a little bit of guidance. And I know how supportive your organisation would be. Uh, and you're a friendly you're a friendly company, you're a friendly voice. You're, you're bored to share ideas from and shout and swear. If things, and you probably know about grants as well, don't you? We know all about grants, Mark. And the interesting thing is, well, we're working with a lot of local authorities whereby people have had issues. And I'll be really, really honest, we've had directors out there who have been taking dividends. Um, they've looked at where the business is going further forward to. They've not been eligible to some government grants and expenditure. Um, and as such, they're saying, where do we go now? There seems to be the route of universal credit. Um, however, if you've got savings, then that might not be a possibility for you either. So we work with individuals to look at what their needs are. Um, and yes, there are a lot of businesses out there at the moment who may have fallen through some of the cracks and have not been able to access government and support yeah. so we're there to sound that through and where we can <coughs> excuse me Mark, where we can we'll actually work on a one-to-one -one basis and look at how we can work with organizations like the department of work and pensions like the local um the local councils the local authorities and also organizations like um new Anglia growth hub and the local enterprise partnerships to see how we can access some funds and yes there are grant pots available can't promise everything to everyone as i always say mark but we can sure as hell give it a really good chance to see where we can place people in, the, in those opportunistic ways excellent alex it's been an absolute pleasure to talk to you i i, I it's so valuable to have us publishing who you are, getting out there because your organisation can support businesses, as we've said, and Felix Stowe, like anybody else, needs that support at the moment. So for the time being, thank you so much. And perhaps we can have a chat in a couple of months and see how things have gone in terms of Felix Stowe and support you've been able to offer. 
It'd be fantastic, Mark. And once again, it's a pleasure to be here having a chat with you and old pal yes. um, and actually moving things forward in a positive way. There are so many things which can be achieved whilst we've got downtime and thinking time. So it doesn't all need to be doom and gloom. Excellent, mate. Thank you so much. Thanks, Mark. Take care. Have a great day. Bye.